Welcome to the world of Mario Maker. Today we will be looking at Carl, a particularly interesting specimen that lives in a box and likes to follow shiny things. He believes he is a brave boy, but in reality we will discover he is just boy. Today he is participating in the fabulous tradition of trolling. Please follow me to the amazing world of Mario Maker. Let's do it. Okay, helmet, get. We have a surprisingly cl Oh no, they can't get the checkpoint yet. Look at all those doors and pipes and things. What's up with that? Obviously, this is a shell jump level. Okay, I'm not gonna put the helmet on. I'm gonna big brain this. We're not wearing it until we have to. We're gonna go in the door first before putting it on. The specimen believes he has a big brain. However, his brain is much smaller than he realizes. All right, fine. I'll put on your hat. <laughs> what was the big brain this? I get out of here. Unbelievable. Well, those. Oh man, these skull platforms could go anywhere. Oh, this, this looks like a spaghetti factory. And I'm ready. Let's go. All platforms were actually legit, though they did in part. Oh, their janky momentum. Okay. I think I hold left. Okay, yeah, there we go. Oh, I hate this. I hate this. Wait, there could be a Kaizo. No Kaizo. No Kaizo. All right. What was that? Oh, this is great. This is very unique. I love this level so far. Where did that even come from? <laughs> ah! All right, gotta go faster than that. It's weird because you have all this momentum from the skull coaster, and then as soon as you touch regular land, it's just all gone. There's the L switch. <laughs> Do I want that? <laughs> All right. Oh, it looks like I just put on, I just get in the dry bone shell and then I jump out of it. But then it looks like I need another one to go up there. So clearly shenanigans are going to happen. He tries the jump. I just don't know what. All right. However, he fails. It just, it's just ground right there. There's no pit. There's no pit. Oh. I am upset. I am dumb. <laughs> Even though he managed to find the path towards success, he still finds ways to achieve uh... failure. I should have hit that or not. Okay, we can break stuff with this. If I'm, okay, I can't go under there. I can break things in here. It doesn't seem like it does anything. Oh no, I see a clown car out there. It's gonna come, it's gonna ram me, isn't it? I'm scared, I'm scared. No! Ah! <laughs> and he did get rammed, and big time. L. Wow, that's a big clown car. All right, we need to race back up to the top. Ugh. What's this all about? All right. What is that, Jenk? Uh. What if I just hold right? Oh, wow. That is actually a very nice setup. I'm actually really impressed that the setup works if you just hold right like that. You just perfectly dodge the piranha plant and sneak your way into that little gap right there. Now this has to have a Kaiser block. I don't believe that this doesn't have a Kaiser block. All right. All right. What is this all? Oh, this is so... This is like... 
I love this aspect of level design. Like this track on the screen with all the coins just makes you wonder like what's gonna happen right there. Hello. I've been working on a troll ROM hack for a while and it's like 70% done. I need the motivation to finish. My motivation to finish is I need to give it to Geek because I'm gonna make it for Geek. I need to give it to her before... I forgot about this. I need to go down that pipe. I need to finish it before she retires. Let's go down here. I... <laughs> right. Run away from Shinyville. <laughs> I might have dodged something there. But it also looks like I need the boot in order to pound this, so... Oh, there was a double boot. I understand. There was a double boot and I had to hold jump to bounce off the other one? Potentially? Um... Oh, that's what happens when you do that. Whoa. Okay, I think I'll get a big jump. No. Oh, there's a wig. There was a winged boot underneath that one. That's what it is. I need the winged boot. So these fish can get you if you're not careful. All right, we want to ditch that one and get this one. And then we can fly up here. And then we can pound this. Okay, how did I just go through that? Um, what am I supposed to do here? I'm holding right. I'm spamming jump. The buttons do not <laughs> That was a really nice setup to get me in that. Because I feel like people can wiggle a lot in that area. Like, they're not going to be lined up in just one spot. That was a really nice funnel. Mario level it. No, 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 no! Oh, I think we're boned. Yeah. Okay. Um. How do I not get absolutely bodied by this? Oh, there we go. There we go. And then I can just go through this. And then when the piece switch ends, we can do this. 30 has been the best decade of your life. In many ways, they have for me as well. <laughs> Got the anxiety and the ADHD and the chronic pain problems all figured out. There's only, there's only, there can only be so many more, right? <laughs> ah! Am I dead? Yep, bot. Bye. <laughs> Wait, buddy, wave. Wait, what? Wait. Benevolent level creator, let's go. Looking less benevolent. Still benevolent. Everything is fine. Wait, wait. <laughs> if you were a professor, you'd give your students homework, and at the end of the semester, you would troll them by saying homework counts only 1% of the grade. I would actually give people, like, I would basically, like, do a very short lecture, and I'd be like, does anybody have any questions? And everybody will be, and I'll be like, are you sure? Like, this is the time. Like, I could, I'd be, I would love to help you guys right now. And they'll be like, nope, no questions. Uh, and then I'll be like, okay, let's do a quiz over what I just talked about. <laughs> and then I would make the quiz not actually worth any points. But I was definitely a troll. I was definitely a troll. <laughs> I got so lucky. I got so lucky. Ah, I got so lucky! I'm unstoppable! No! He got away at first, uh, but he wasn't as lucky the third time. Okay, does this fly away to victory? It does. I love that. Wait, is that the actual solution? Could I have made it in the door? You got pinball elbow when you played pinball for too long? That sounds right, right? No, I forgot. I'm gonna hold right. No, you can't quite make it. Okay. 
Ah, what is that wiggler doing? That's wild. All right, we wait for it to go back once, and then we go. And then I stop! What makes the pow change directions? I have no idea. It might just literally do that. Like, um, it might not move. I'm thinking that the... Let's look and see if there's any difference. Wow, that is a crazy glitch. Um, let's look and see if there's any difference in the piranha plants. I'm thinking that the piranha plants are probably not perfectly symmetrical, or they're not perfectly squares even. So like, they have, um, like the hitbox on that line of piranhas has some dips in it. And my guess is that the piranha plant doesn't move like one piranha length exactly, pixel perfectly. So eventually as it's moving, it's slowly desyncing and then it hits one of the like divots between them and then goes back. They're visibly desynced. Yeah, this one right here is weird, isn't it? This one, I guess all over there, it's weird. but I don't know if that's necessarily anything to do with how the power moves the way it does. I really wanted to get that shiny. Oh, there was a... The small Carl was a little too impatient this time, but he learned a valuable lesson for his next attempt. No, 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 I need to get the brain. It seems he has learned nothing. After all this time, the list of things this Carl has learned remains empty. Shiny get. Ooh, I think a switch hit. Is that bad? Okay. Looks like I just go in there. We're gonna go up here just in case. Nothing up here. All right, we're just gonna go under here. I think this is fine. <laughs> what? Get back out of here. Who invited you? Nobody invited the plant. Oh my gosh. I watched uh, Shoujo play like, I don't know, like a couple hours maybe of, of Soma. And she was just freaking out and then quit. <laughs> Oh no, so looks scary. I would like um, recommendations for spoopy games. To I like to play one spoopy game on Halloween, and that is my that's my spoop limit. I was thinking Alien Isolation. Okay, I have to go get these, and then I have to run. What? Why is that inside that pal? Um, it looks like if I throw this right here, we're good. Is that good or no? Nah! Bye. Okay, I do want that. And then I think we wait here. See, that launcher moved, and I thought thing. It is very unlikely for Carl's to retain information for more than three seconds. Okay, don't put on helmet. <laughs> what is this setup? <laughs> But the level creator prepared for cars that did retain information. They are one step ahead, or more than one. What is this setup? Moves! I didn't notice that it was moving. Wow, this level is phenomenal. I am not, though. I love that setup. Stand like in the middle. It fell through the middle! Wait, wait, wait. I thought it was coming out of one of those three. That, I swear that just fell straight through the middle of that. What was that? They were indeed more than one step ahead. Am I crazy? Did it not come right in between those blocks? Okay, wait, just keep moving. There we go, keeping moving is the play. Oh, no. <laughs> Do I have to? Ah! <laughs> okay, just jump. <sighs> All right. Get the mushroom. All right. But now what? Oh. Huh? <laughs> An exciting demonstration of the neon, a phenomenon we only see in Mario Maker. <laughs> uh. <laughs>
<laughs> this, I'm sorry, this level, I just... Oh my god. <laughs> I fucking can't. Oh god, it's so funny. I love this level. Bravo. Yeah, I was thinking of the same thing, Mass SP, and that Mario Maker 1 level where it takes, like, the biggest path through a maze, and then it just leaps over you. Amazing. Boing. GG! Uh, it does look like the end of the level right there, but what's the situation with the door? You can't make that jump. You can't make that jump. It's too far. Fine. Oh, I didn't go in the door! That was a door! I was holding up and like right because the d-pad is so shit and so it tried to get me to go in the door well i want to see what's in the door anyway so i'm going in oh god <laughs> what if i go in one of these doors what if i go in this door what if i go in this door here we see the ante Carls love to spend time inside antis. They can impress mating partners by being successful at dying without using the pity death. Fuck is this frog suit ante? <laughs> well, this is hell. It is indeed a version of hell. Welcome to hell. No. Hey, we didn't get CP1 or CP0. Alright. That why is that coming right at me? Ah! <laughs> Oh, that was a wonderful level. Yeah, I, I don't think I've ever played a level by this maker before. Um, but that was that was incredible. Nice job. And again, this is the person, uh, Chai Latte, in chat. Thank you so much for making this level. That was fantastic. I loved it. Thank you for joining us in this wonderful journey. It seems both you and I have learned nothing, just like wild Carls do every day. Tune in next time to see if the list of things Carl has learned increased. This was the wonderful world of Mario Maker. Pee-pee-poo-poo. -pee